Travis is with us in Atlanta, Georgia. Hi, Travis. How are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? Better than I deserve, sir. What's up? Well, um, I've just recently started listening to your show on XM, and you kind of kicked the wind out of me. And uh, I got your book, and I'm reading it. And my question is, I'm in Chapter 6, and it says you have, before you get started, you have to be current with all your creditors. And right now, I'm robbing Peter to pay Paul. <laughs> I mean, it's tough. I'm, you know, I'm up to my eyeballs. And I was just wanting to know, what's the first thing? What, how do I break that cycle? Like, how do I dig my way out? Gotcha. Okay. Um, my screen says you're recovering from bankruptcy. Are you in a BK? Yeah, yeah. I, uh... About four years ago, I, I had a big problem with addiction, and I filed Chapter 7 bankruptcy, and luckily my wife didn't leave me. <laughs> mm. uh, she's still with me, and we have three kids, and Good. I, I just want to take the second chance to, you know, rebuild my life. And Amen. I okay. just, it's, just ba- it's tough to bounce back, yeah. So you be, you've been dry three years? Oh, yeah. yeah Where'd yeah. it go, man? She, she, she actually left me on New Year's, and that was my, uh, that was my rock bottom. <laughs> yeah, that, that'll do it. I'll do it. Um, so, what were you addicted to? Uh, pharmaceuticals, prescription pain gotcha. pills. Okay. Good for you, man. That's a tough one to break. It In is. Three it years is. You're really I'm proud of and you. It's a lifelong battle, but I appreciate that. Yeah, I'm proud of you. So, what is your income? Of uh, about fifty-five. Okay. And how much debt have you got? Uh, around sixty. Okay. All on, together. On what? Well, I owe thirty thousand to uh family members mm-hmm. and I have some small loans and about eighteen thousand on my car. Mm-hmm. Are you paying anything on the family members right now at all? Uh no. Okay. All right. So, um out of the fifty thousand there's not you know, half of it you're not paying anything on right now. Well, except my everyday bills and the small yeah. loans and stuff yeah. like that. How much is your house payment? Uh, five fifty. Okay, that's not out of line. Good. Okay. Um, I rent. I rent. I'm, I'm not. Okay, that's mortgage. fine. That's fine. All right. Uh, more than anything, what you guys need is a detailed plan, and you and your wife working together to stick to that plan. Okay. Mm-hmm. Because when I start going down the list of things with your household income, you said you make. What did you say? Fifty-five or sixty. Fifty-five. You make fifty-five thousand dollars. Okay. I know you got enough to pay food. I know you got enough to pay lights and water. I know you got enough to pay your rent, and I know you got enough to pay the car payment. Yes, sir. And um, and I know you're wasting some money because everybody does, especially oh, yeah. when up you're until first six weeks ago. I I was completely irresponsible. Yeah. Up but that's just it's just normal. That's just normal. That's okay. And um. This is the last thing to clean up in your in your process of healing that you're going through. So it's great. I mean, we're just sweeping out the corners here together, brother. It's all good. You're going to get there. You're going to get there. So a written plan. We're going to put you on a thing called Every Dollar, which is an app for your phone or your computer. Um, you and your wife together. And you're going to start tracking mm-hmm. every dollar before it leaves. Because if we just took a yellow pad right now and we wrote down your payments... And we wrote down your income at the top. And then you looked at the difference. You'd be going, where's the rest of that money going? Absolutely. That, that, that's what I'm talking about. You're gonna, when you get organized the way I'm going to teach you to, you're going to feel like you've got a raise. <laughs> okay? And the other thing is this. One of the things that we work with a lot of folks that are uh, coming back from addiction and some that are even in it. Um, one of the things you rebuild with your spouse is trust. Yes. Yes. And, and trust is rebuilt on the money side, and communication is increased on the money side better than just about any other area. So this is going to be a great tool for healing your marriage, you two learning to work together to fight this debt monster together. And there's going to be a lot of communication about where the money's going. Y'all are going to be talking about it. You're going to be making the decisions together. It's going to increase communication and trust in your marriage. So it's going to have some effects on your life that are going to be awesome that hadn't really got anything to do with money. And it's a natural part of where, right where you are. It's, this is a perfect time for you. So here's what we're going to do. We have a one-year membership to a thing called Financial Peace University. 
It includes connectivity to your bank for this every dollar app on budgeting, which is about a hundred dollar thing. It includes any of the videos of two or three of our classes are all in there. It includes community in there. And here's the most important part. There's nine lessons that are taught at a local church near you, a bunch of local churches near you in Atlanta. You pick one and you go to those nine lessons as well on how to handle money. One of those is how to do a budget. One of those is how to get out of debt. One of those is how to work with your spouse about money. And you're, you and your spouse are going to go to those, and I'm going to pay for all of it. It's free. Oh, man. Okay? So I'm going to be part of your healing. I want to be part of your story because you're a hero. You're, you. you're winning, and I want to be part of that. I, want, I like being around heroes. So, And then when, you, uh, when, when you're you know, winning at this area and you're working with one of the guys over at your 12-step area or something, and you see one of these guys who's right where you are and you're two years ahead of him, you'll know what to do. You can put him in. You can pay for it put him into financial peace. You can do that. You can pay it forward then, okay? Yes, sir. You'll be able to help somebody else once you're not broke anymore. Agreed? Absolutely. All right. You can do this, man. And I'm right here. I'm not going anywhere. So if you need some help as you go along, you call me again, okay? Yes, sir. How old are you? 27. Love it. You got this. For my wife and kids, you know, I don't think I'll be able to bounce back. So that that building trust with my wife is a huge thing. Yeah. Yeah, you're bouncing back. You're the kind of guy that does that. You can do it. You got this. I'm proud of you. Well done. Hold on. Kelly's going to pick up, and she's going to get you signed up and get you into all those classes and all that membership and everything and show you how to do everything. And uh, we got this for you. We're going to walk with you. I want to be part of this story. I like being part of stories when people are winning. Open phones at 888-825-5225. You jump in. We'll talk about your life and your money. You see, there's something we know about addicts. We worked with them for 30 years. 100% of them have money problems. You don't get out of it because it, it's it, whatever it is that's eating you on the inside that you're that you're hooked into, it's going to take all your money eventually. It might not right off the bat, but if you're a gambling addict, you're a porn addict, you're a prescription drug addict, you're cocaine or alcohol, a hundred percent of you end up broke until you get healing for the addiction. One hundred percent. Nobody makes it out. So you got to beat it. And Travis is beating it. Y'all pray for him. This is the Dave Ramsey Show.